this is my fantastic flight simulator. Here's the glare shield, and it's all actually it's actually on a hinge. And then here is what inside of the simulator looks like. I've, when I mounted the monitor, I didn't really have a high-tech solution, so I just used the circuit. But then I got extra fancy, and I used these blind mount for that for it, and it just slides in there. It does make a little mark right there, but that's okay. Here's my glove box. It's not actually too fancy. I just kind of duct taped it together. Um, and here's what it kind of looks like. There's a cord coming in for the light switch. And then I just hot glued batteries. Pretty sure that's not exactly safe, but that's good enough for me. Inside here you can see my sprinkler pipe and plywood construction. It's actually pretty nice, pretty sturdy, and pretty cheap. I'm all for that. There's the yoke that I mounted. I just used part of a drawer and then got a 90 degree anchor and screwed it on. Right here is the pedestal light. It's not actually working right now. Just have to wire it up. And then here is my little juice box dispenser. There's the motor. It's hooked up to like a stick. And the stick spins and whacks the door open. It's actually controlled by two double A's. Or triple A's. And then here's the inside of the push pull buttons. Doesn't look as cool, but that is a okay. Here's what the rudder pedals look like. Here's the megaphone, and here's the parking brake. Actually, it's really low profile because I don't think airplanes actually come with it anymore, and people don't actually use it. But I use it in simulation, so that's good for me. I kind of just mounted this with basically one screw. I know that's kind of sketch, but that's okay. And here is the switch back, and then there's back of the uh, other switch. Here are the seven switches right here. Only f three or four of them are actually hooked up to lights outside of the cockpit. I'll show you those later. Here's what the ignition switch looks like. I just made a little box to like carry this and there's a little hole in it so that it doesn't move. Wire management can be a big problem. So I get wiring electrical tape in different colors sometimes. And this is the control hub, and so there's the throttle, the yoke, and the Logitech pedals, and they're all on one USB thing. You plug that into the computer and you're golden. I know inside the simulator doesn't look nearly as good as outside the simulator, but that is a-okay. And I hope to give you some tutorials someday. Thank you so much for watching, and remember that life is a journey, so keep on flying.